So I wanted to talk about this because it happens quite often. So let's assume you have a group of friends, but then there's this one friend who's like, she's not your friend, you just see her. And she's off by herself a lot and it seems as though she has no friends and then you feel bad and you invite her into your group of friends and introduce her to everyone and then shortly after you introduce her to everyone she begins to try to box you out of the group why do people do that I, I never I, I don't understand First of all, I don't know why anyone would try to box out anyone else from a group of friends. Secondly, why is it that it's always the person that introduced them into the group that becomes their target? Why? So I kind of want to talk about that. So if you've ever experienced this, you would know what I'm talking about. Um, and I think the reason why, I, I assume the reason why they do this is because they feel as though the person that introduced them to the group have too much power in the group. Or maybe they take, they, they take attention from them in the group. Because if you don't consider someone a threat to you in some way, you wouldn't make them a target. You know? So there are many ways that people do this and just in case you've never been aware of it, I'm just going to list a couple of ways that I have seen that people do this. Okay. So let's say you introduce person A into your group. They begin to try to be very good friends with every other member of the group and they try to disrespect you or disregard you in one way or another. So for instance, if if you introduce someone to a group, like you introduce person A, right? You and another friend in the group begin to argue. Person A will side with the other person. Or if you guys are supposed to go somewhere um, together and um, somehow you have to make it in separate trips. So let's say I have to drive there and the other friend has to drive there. Person A that I invite into the group will try to go to this destination that she is not even aware of with the other member of the group, not with me who introduced her to the group and, you know, was first to really try to get to know her. And that is done in an attempt to form a closer friendship with the other friend of the group. And try to sort sort of push you out of the picture. I just think it's a very um, low thing to do to someone that you know introduced you to a group of friends. I mean, if anything, you your loyalty, if it has to lie most strongly with anyone, should lie with the person that introduced you to the group because they are the first person to notice you or even bother to try to get to know you but um it so happens that there's a lot of people out there like that and it happens it's happened to me in school it's happened to me at work where you know i'm friends with someone and then a new person comes in maybe comes into the job and i become friends with that new person right and we're a friendship develops and we're like closer friends than I am with this other person that I used to know and then this other person suddenly starts trying to be super close friend and hang out with me and then as soon as I say yes you can hang out with us me and my other friend she comes into the friendship and tries to box me out and it's like and she tries so hard there's this particular person who does this and she tries so hard to be very close friends with my friend who is only friends with her because i'm friends with her but she doesn't know that you know it's like it's very funny it's very funny because 
the person that tries to box me out is not aware that the only reason the other people in the group are friends with her or him is because I am friends with them and I introduce them to the group. And as soon as my friendship with her, him or her ends, so will their friendship. Not because I tell them, but just because they saw her, like, especially speaking about this particular girl that um, I used to know, um, we went to school together. And the group, my friend friendship group, sort of, um, they were introduced to her through me. And when she tried to box me out and... All the while, I knew that they didn't really, they didn't hate her, but they didn't care much for her. And the only reason why they were friends with her is because I'm friends with her and I introduced her to the group and I will invite her to like, to our hangouts and things. So she would try to, um, agree with something that I disagree. When I disagree with something, she would make sure she agrees with them on that and it's not that she always has to disagree when I disagree but there's a pointed way that she goes about it as if it doesn't matter what it is as long as I disagree with them she's gonna agree with them just so that she can have a closer relationship and it's so obvious and they don't really regard her um, with a high level of respect and she does not know that they that they feel this way about her because they're still very civil towards her and they're still friendly towards her but they don't consider what they have true friendship but she does not know this and she just tries so hard to box out the only person that truly like values her as a person and bother to introduce her to the group so if you have someone that does stuff like this here's my advice okay don't let it get to you. Don't get into the struggle with them on who's going to be friends with who. Just go about doing your things the way you always have. Be nice to everyone, but just keep it in mind. Keep it in mind that you cannot trust a person like that because they clearly don't have your best interest at heart. So don't open up to them. Don't introduce them to people that you truly, truly care about next time because you've learned your lesson. You've seen them for who they really are. And yeah, just be aware because people are so weird. People are just so strange. It's like, why can't you just live your life and just be, and just let other people live? You know, it's like, why do all this manipulative little things just to turn one person against the other? I don't, I don't get why people do that. So yeah, that's just my advice. Just keep being yourself, be friends with people that are honest friends with you and people that are not honest friends with you keep them at arm's length don't introduce them to more people that you know because what's the point of that they're just going to bring toxicity into the friendship right thank you guys for listening i'll see you in my next video bye guys